Calvary family, check out this list of events that we will have over the next few weeks. If you have not done so already, please take advantage of online giving today by signing up at our website, www.cbcjny.org. Calvary Sisters, be here on Saturday, March 12th at 10 a.m. as Women Bible Study continues downstairs at our Calback Senior Housing. The subject will be, but I was just sharing a prayer request, Gossip and Hearsay, which comes from the work and textbook, Keep It Shut. Your instructor will be First Lady Marvalu Jala Hall. Calvary, we're still compiling information for our new church database. Before you leave, be sure to fill out a membership card which you can receive from one of our ushers. We invite you and your family to call in to Calvary's Lenten Season Prayer Line, which will run through our 40 days of fasting every night except for Sundays at 10 o'clock p.m. The conference call-in number is 712 712- 432-1212. The access code is 494-010-931. See the Connections Corner for more details. Remember, nobody knows your story, but we can all give God the glory. During Lent, we are looking to read the book Autopsy of a Deceased Church by Tom S. Rayner as a church body. This is a five-week book study. The book will be discussed Sunday mornings during the normal Sunday school time. Everyone interested in taking the class must register downstairs with Deacon Walker or Sister Walker Garrett. You can purchase the book for $8 or feel free to download on your Android tablets, iPads, or Kindles. We encourage all of you to join us for our first Encounter Study course. Continue to join us every Wednesday after Ash Wednesday for our Lenten services. Our first two evangelists will be Minister Deshaun Robinson from Second St. John's Baptist Church in Brooklyn, New York on February 17th. I've got to remind us, as believers, we started running from pain. As believers, we, we started running from the bitter things. But don't you know it was that heartbreak that brought you nigh unto the presence of God? Yeah. Don't you know it was that dry season that brought you really understand he was living world? Don't you know it was those moments where it was nobody but God? And Minister Nicole Caldwell Gross from St. Mark's United Methodist Church in Mount Clare, New Jersey on February 24th. But many of us have been hiding our gifts, hiding our graces, hiding our abilities, hiding our dreams, hiding our hopes, hiding our purpose, hiding our very selves because we are still haunted by our history. The month of August will have a meeting on Sunday, March 6th after our 7.30 and 11 a.m. services. Everyone born in the month of August is asked to attend. Calvary, we will take a walk up the street to join our brothers and sisters at Amity Baptist Church on Sunday, March 6th at 3.30 p.m. Service will begin at 4 o'clock p.m. You can sign up today at the Connections Corner if you plan on joining us. Save the date for our Holy Week Revival services that will begin on March 22nd through the 24th and our seven last word service that will be on Friday, March 25th. Coming up on March 11th at 7.30 p.m., brothers, we will hold our first Man Cave Unplugged. This is a time for brothers to come together and express yourself on issues of today that are important to you. More information, including the facilitator, will be given in the coming weeks. Make sure you mark your calendars. This event is free and open to all men ages 18 and up. You can register for Man Cave Unplugged today down in Fellowship Hall. We need everyone to set a reminder that beginning Sunday, March 13th, we will shift the time of our early service from 7.30 a.m. to 8 o'clock a.m. Our website is under construction, but in the meantime, you can visit our temporary website, www.cbcjny.org, or you can like us on our Facebook page at Calvary Baptist Church, Jamaica, New York, our Instagram page at CBCJNY, and our Twitter page at CBCJNY.
Thank you so much for worshiping with us today at Calvary Baptist Church, the friendly church on the boulevard. Have a blessed week.